This incident has been an emotional event for the community and the sheriff's office. The sheriff's office would like to thank DCI and the Tennessee County Prosecutor's Office and the Cuyahoga County Prosecutor's Office for their assistance in this matter. On March 16, 2014, at 7.10 p.m., deputies were called to 3425 Mill Run Road, Lexington, Ohio, in response to a domestic dispute. Sarah Knowlton, wife of Brian Garber, and Brian's mother, Connie Garber, told deputies they had been physically assaulted by Brian Garber. Brian Garber left the area on foot prior to the deputy's arrival. A check of the area was done, but he could not be located. At 8.17 p.m., Sarah Knowlton called 911 and advised that her husband had a gun and was now across the street at his parents' house 30, at 3400 Mullen Road. Upon arriving at 3400 Mullen Road, Sergeant Nicholson, Deputy Frazier, Deputy Nee, and Lieutenant Zaner entered the residence and Matthew Garber directed them to the upstairs bedroom. Upon reaching the bedroom, the deputy spoke to Brian Garber and tried to convince him to surrender and drop his perceived weapon. Shots were fired, Sergeant Nicholson, Deputy Frazier, and Deputy Nee all fired their weapons. At approximately 8.24 p.m., Lieutenant Zaner reported to dispatch that shots were fired. Lieutenant Zaner requested a squad and requested Major Massey be called to the scene. Upon receiving notification from dispatch, Major Massey immediately directed FBI to be called, I'm sorry, ECI to be called in a crime scene and investigated. An investigation was immediately turned over to them. This was done to ensure that a full, fair, and unbiased investigation would be completed by an independent agency. On my way to the scene, I contacted the chaplain for the sheriff's office so that he could meet with the deputies and the Gerber family. BCI contacted the coroner. BCI conducted an indep independent investigation of the shooting. The results of their investigations were forwarded to the Cuyahoga County Prosecutor's Office for review. The Richland County Prosecutor's Prosecutor's Office had requested a special prosecutor to be appointed to, to avoid the appearance of any conflict of interest.